All right, guys. Hey, I am Rhett with the Mix Club, and today in this video, let me go ahead and start my timer here. I'm trying to keep my videos, you know, on track so I don't ramble as much. But anyway, guys, this is uh, wrapping up on this little series here, basically expensive gear versus cheaper gear. And I don't want anybody to think that my opinion, this is what I think. I think whatever it takes for you to move forward in your career, whether it's something cheap as hell, that's all you can afford, fine. If you can afford better, then I would. That's all I'm saying here. And, you know, here's a little story on something that happened to me. You don't hear a lot of people talking about, you know, hard times that they had in the studio when the pandemic hit. Everybody just kind of seems, you know, to wish everybody well and all that, but they really don't talk about how hard it affected their business. Um, man, I don't know what planet a lot of people are fucking on, but it hurt the hell out of me. And I've been doing this for a lot of years. I had three or four different hustles going on. They all just stopped. You know, but not a lot of videos you see people actually, you know, talking about that side of it. Um, and so here's something that helped me, um, you know, and I'll share this with you. I'm not ashamed of it. It is what it is. Um, I had wanted a new set of headphones for the studio and I went and I did some shopping and I went where I actually sat down and tested out headphones. Okay. And I went all through the gamut of everything that, you know, I thought I wanted. And I ended up picking the Neumanns. That's what I wanted. And man, they weren't cheap. They were five, six hundred bucks. Okay. And if I could have got something that was a little cheaper and I'd like the sound of, I would have. But these were made well. They were closed back. But for me, I'm such a low end guy, you know, coming from live engineering and stuff like I just want to fill the low end. Felt like you could get in there and just edit whatever you needed to edit on them. Okay, so where's this story going? Well when the pandemic hit, guys, it did a shit show on everything I had going on. It took a while to recover from that. I mean it was not good. I had a friend that I was doing work for that I haven't talked to him since. He just like disappeared and it was a good chunk of income for me, right? I mean, yeah, he's a good friend, didn't he? You know, hope never see him again. Um, you know, and like I said, I'm not complaining, but, you know, I haven't seen a lot of videos where people, you know, actually share that their business wasn't doing so great. You know, it about killed me. And part of what was good is those headphones, because they were nice, they had a resale value, okay? And the dude that I sold them to was... Uh, extremely happy to get them and i was extremely happy to sell them for what i got for them okay and so that is something to consider when you buy gear buy what you like even if it's a little cheaper but if you can afford to get what you want so you don't have to replace you know that's great because here's the end of the story i'm going to be getting some headphones again in here that I I have headphones all over, but I'm going to get some more that I like for mastering and working on. Do you want to know what headphones I'm going to get? I'm going back and get the same Neumann headphones because they were that good. But anyway, the, the whole thing on this is it's not a pity thing. It's just to let you know that, hey, the, yeah, the pandemic really did hurt me. Maybe some of you guys it didn't, but it really was kind of a shit show. Um but when you buy gear, I still think you definitely check out used. That's a great option. I don't do a lot of used because I'm always scared of doing it. I'll buy used if it's from somebody I know. It's a buddy of mine that's not going to, you know, sell me a piece of turd. But anyway, guys, I am Rhett with the Mix Club. Got to keep these videos short. This is the last one in the series, kind of on cheap gear, expensive gear. And I want to get done before this timer goes off because it plays a song. And I know we all are going to hate hearing that because I'm not going to edit it out. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I'm Rhett with the Mix Club, man. Be safe, y'all. See you later.